This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and I just opened a package from a viewer named Kyle in Texas. He told me he found an odd lock he hadn't seen before and wanted to see what I could do with it. It appears to be a copy of an Abloy Classic Cam Lock. It's like most other disc detainer locks, but for the offset D-shaped keyway. This is obviously going to require a special tool to open up, because the one I made with Bosnian Bill simply isn't going to fit in that keyway. But it just so happens that I did make one that would a couple of months ago. The tip is actually a copy of a design by Matt Smith in the UK. He is a 7th generation locksmith, an extraordinarily talented toolmaker, and probably the world's leading expert on disc detainer locks. This design is so good because it can defeat the anti-pick discs that are used by Abloy. And in fact, those discs are found in this copy as well, without the false gates. The common Chinese pick that's supposed to be able to open these D-shaped keyways won't even engage those anti-pick discs. Now, I did make a few mistakes when putting this together. The geometry of the tips is off by just a little bit, enough to make a difference on some of the higher end locks, and I'm not entirely happy with these handles. I'll probably change that as well. So think of this as a rough draft, but it is more than good enough to open this lock. So that's what we're going to do right now. Let's get it in a vise and see what happens. Okay, the first thing we need to do is rotate all of those discs as far clockwise as they will go. Then we will insert this pick, and we're going to start picking in the back. We're tensioning off of disc 8, so I'm on number 7. It feels loose. Click out of 6. Click out of 5. Click out of 4. Click out of 3. Click out of two, and we open this up. Number one must have been a zero cut disc. So let's get this pick out first. So as you saw, there's nothing inherently harder about picking these D-shaped keyways, but you do have to have the correct tool. And right now it is a specialty item. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe, and as always, have a nice day. Thank you.